Okay, so I have sort of a themed haul for you guys here today and it clearly was not planned. It just happened to pan out that way. And so if you're not already subscribed to my channel, I like to encourage you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, I like to welcome you to the family and go on ahead and click that notification icon as well so that you never miss a beat. So if you want to see all the goodies and treasures I found, this time around then all you have to do is continue watching so the contents of my dish bin is from my trip to the Dollar Tree and then I have two items from a quick drive-by that I made to the uh, Dollar General which I'm going to share with you on this video because it's only two things and it's not worthy of making a whole video for so I'm just gonna kind of pair it together with this uh, video as well and so I'm gonna go ahead and start with the items that I have of course in my dish bin from the Dollar Tree so for starters this time around i was able to find some of these string like garden garlands i'm sorry and this is from the uh, luminescence brand and they're just little sparkly uh garland balls and they uh, illuminate and they come with six bulbs on each strand and I thought that was really good for a dollar. They also had them in gold glitter as well, but I opted to come home with the silver. And then I found these little novelty glasses with the little reindeer antlers and the holly berry. And they're just little uh, brown novelty glasses with the little sparkly uh, glitter on it and they're a little bedazzled and blinged out. And I thought they were cute and I picked them up. Um, I'm assuming that Dollar Tree has been putting this line out uh, item per item because my last couple of hauls, I was able to pick up the uh, towel, the oven mitt, and the pot holder and find the um, table mat. And so now this time around, I found the um, washcloths or the dish rags whatever you want to call them so i'm assuming that that's it for this line and there's nothing else in this pattern nonetheless i think i'm done and so i'm glad i was able to find this and so while i was there uh snooping around in the kitchen section i did find um this one hand towel and it's the uh gingerbread cookies hand towel that everybody's been hauling and it has the entire recipe uh, of ingredients to make uh, gingerbread cookies so I'm assuming they're doing the same thing to me that they did with this set and they're bringing it in one at a time because I was only able to find the uh, dish towel I didn't find the oven mitt or the um, pot holders for this set so I'm hoping that you know the next couple of times that I pop into my Dollar Tree I'll be able to find them then I also picked up this little um, nine-piece cake decorator set. And now Dollar Tree has always had um, a cake decorator set there that's kind of like a sack. It's kind of um, like a plastic sack. And I bought it. And yeah, it's not the sturdiest. Um, I'm not much of a baker, but um, occasionally for special occasions and holidays and such, I do like to do some baking. And the other the one that they had I wouldn't recommend it so I opted to give this one a shot because it's not a Dollar Tree brand and it's in this plastic like um kind of like a cylinder it's not the fabric one that Dollar Tree had so um I'm gonna give it a shot and see how that one goes for me as opposed to the one they had and then they had from the uh, cooking concepts this is a uh, create your own lighted bottles and so I guess they're like um LED wired lights and you just put them inside the bottle and you can take any um, decor bottle that you have that has any kind of sentimental value and turn it into a beautiful little decor item. So I thought that was really cool. And then my favorite finds for this time around 
were I was looking for the uh, Let It Snow uh, wall decor plot. And so I finally scored them and I was so happy. I picked up two, one for a backup. So I just think it's so pretty as is on its own. I didn't want to alter it so that I can use it for the season. And then I picked one up as a backup to do a DIY with. And then I found the famous red truck that everybody's been scoring and I was so happy they had exactly one left and it was just sitting there on the shelf waiting for me so I picked this little bad boy up and then I also was able to find the infamous uh red truck gift boxes so they come in uh three different sizes and so I'm going to show you the sizes from largest to smallest so that you can see the difference. This is obviously the largest and then this is the uh, medium and then this is the smallest one and so it's not much of a difference. It's just a slight difference from the medium to the smallest. Let me see if I can show you here. Here we go on top. So it's just a very, very slight, like maybe a quarter of an inch on each side. And so I picked up all three and I was so happy about that. And then lastly, and but not least, I found two items at my local Dollar General that I was happy to find as well. And I thought I would share them with you. I went into my dollar general actually i went in looking for the salt and pepper shakers of the uh, red truck i couldn't find it just like i went into the dollar tree looking for the uh, red truck um little platter you know they have the um what do you call it like the salad plate or cookie platter from the dollar tree with the red truck on it i didn't find that but i was happy that i was able to find the mug at least and I went into Dollar General looking for the salt and pepper shaker. I didn't find that, but I was happy. I was able to score the set of the uh, red truck. I got the um, hand towel. And it says, cut your own Christmas tree farm. Find first spruce cedar. And it has the um, red truck. And so I picked up all three. The oven mitt the pot holder and the hand towel. And then last and least, I found this little doohickey here for a stocking stuffer, which I thought was cute. And it says, the eyes have it from the color workshop. And it's just a little travel size um, makeup brush kit. And uh, it's a set that brings, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, I think six brushes. And it says blending is my cardio. So I thought this would make a cute little stocking stuffer in addition to a holiday gift and that my subby friends is it and this concludes my haul so give this video a thumbs up if you like anything that you've seen here throughout this haul and you know as we all know not all dollar trees are created the same and so the tip is you got to go out there and hunt if you see anything on somebody else's video that you think you might benefit from you just jot it down on your wish list and you can't give up you got to visit low, uh, several dollar trees because you know like i said not all dollar trees are created equal so you want to might want to go and speak to your store's manager and find out you know what what are the days that they're getting in their shipments what days the trucks come in and give it a day or so for them to you know load the inventory onto the shelves and then come back and you know sometimes you get lucky sometimes you don't but it's all about the hunt you know for me anyway it's kind of like a scavenger hunt and so i'm glad to have been able to come on here and share my finds with you this time around like i said i hope you enjoyed uh don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you're not already subscribed do so and i'll meet you back here in my next video bye now